Hey YouTube, welcome back. Uh, today I'm going to show you guys a tutorial on how to uh, sync your drone with your uh, Mac or vice versa. Or you could do it uh, on your Windows PC as well or your iMac or your MacBook Air or MacBook Pro, whatever MacBook Mini you have. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, get it started. Uh, first of all, you need to uh, fully charge your battery, okay? And you want to insert your battery. Make sure you click in. Make sure the button is uh, pop up all the way up. Okay, just like that. You want to turn your drone. This is the back of your drone. Turn it sideways. Where you see there's a USB uh, symbol right there, and just uh, pop it open with your fingernail, and that will reveal that uh, micro USB uh, adapter right there. And you grab your uh, data cable that come with it. Okay. So make sure you the the wider is on the bottom, okay? I'm not sure why it's not focused right now. Okay. And then you got your symbol right there that's uh, the B is on top. So make sure you go in straight. You don't want to jiggle it. Uh, this is what I'm going to show you, okay? Make sure you straight in only. And don't force it too hard. Or you're going to break that, uh, that port or the connector. Okay, that's it. Because when you jiggle it, as you can see, it moves the uh, camera as well I'm, I'm pretty sure they have a gimbal inside there so it allows you to move around but you don't want to keep on jiggle and then make it you know, worse okay and after that you want to go ahead and then uh, connect uh, your USB cable in onto your MacBook Unless you you have a USB Type C, then you need a special adapter or converter. Okay, and all you do is uh, push the power on the back of your drone. Okay, and just uh, wait for your uh, Mac to uh, show up. The, the drive and uh, they did not discover the or show you guys how many gigabyte of the memory on this drone and this is what I'm going to show you to you guys okay as you can see right now it shows a uh, no name I'm going to do a OBS uh, recording on this so you guys can see it real quick. As you can see, it shows a uh, no name for this uh, drone. Okay, all you do is uh, double click it, and you will sh open up this uh, folder. It shows a uh, no name. Okay, and it has a DCIM. Normally, uh, DCIM is where they uh, store your pictures and then uh, videos under this uh, folder. You could also double click it to go in. 
So this is drawn. This drawn is a brand new, fresh. So there's no, no files are uh, in here right now. Okay, I haven't recorded anything yet. And there's uh, also a miscellaneous uh, folder right there. You could go in. I'm not sure what is in there. So it's it's, it's uh, it is empty. And then uh, if you want to see what's a bit, what is the size of the memory card in your drone, you can go into uh, no name and then uh, double. I mean, uh, press uh, two finger on your uh, MacBook, or you're gonna press a right click mouse on your Windows PC, and just go under uh, get infos. And it shows uh, it shows a uh, fifteen point four four gigabyte of available uh, spaces right now. That means uh, the internal memory has a uh, sixteen gigabyte of uh, memory on on board for this uh, drone. Okay. So in case you record 4K videos, it's gonna fill up the memory uh, real quick, okay? But anyway, the drones don't only allow you to fly uh, 12 minutes unless you have uh, another backup battery. You could uh, record more. And once you record it, you could also use your uh, smartphone or your tablet to transfer those files directly to your devices, okay? Or your Android phones. So I figured I'd make this uh, video real quick for you guys to understand on how to uh, check the memory and how to connect your uh, drone to your computer or your PC, notebook, laptop, whatever. Because uh, it does not say anything on the instruction and uh, I don't see any memory cost slot so I was just uh, wondering so how do you store your uh, picture and videos so I finally decided to connect the to the computer and this is what it shows and that's why I like to make this uh, kind of video to share with you guys in case you guys uh, got this uh, unique uh, breeze uh, 4k and didn't know what to do or try to find out uh, more info about it this video would help you through that and please uh, be sure to like this video and then give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you haven't do so yet and turn on that bell for notification uh, i will do uh, more full in depth full review about this strong uh, upcoming videos. I know I've been busy with all this unboxing and some other tutorial this and that. So I will try to keep it up. All right. Anyway, please share this with your friend, family on social media and turn on that bell for notification and drop any other comments on below. All right. Thank you for watching and I'll see you guys on the next uh, video. Like always, peace out guys.